What's up guys, my name is Mango here, and welcome to back to Red Dead Redemption 2. In the last video, we saved a girl named Sadie Adler, and now I'm with my Mexican amigo Javier, and we're going to find a man named John. Let's see if we can find him. There's some tracks leading to the river. Yeah! Whoa! A few hours ago, most. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Biggest John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, oh, it seemed fine. Anything. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> Tracks go left. Down here. What? That's good. Davey got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Doesn't, doesn't go wrong. And hopefully you guys having a good day today. Careful, it's getting narrow here. Oh, that's beautiful. Snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. We can't follow nothing. Right, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there. Come on. I feel like we're in the Himalayas. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Oh, Jesus. Let's see if he can. Where's that us. yellow snow? Come on. Up there. He's gonna piss himself like that. Careful. I 
Watch your head here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Gap here. This sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John! Oh, I can't even climb up this high in real life. scratch you got there never thought I'd say this but good to see you Arthur Morgan Jesus you look so young you don't look so good I don't feel too good neither <clears throat> freezing <clears throat> don't die just yet cowboy Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Uh oh. Look up there. Parf. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Okay. Here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Oi, doggos, get over here. We're getting you out of here. Hey, keep them away from us. Over here. Hey. Man, that was a good hey, distance. Back up. Back up. Oh, ow. If you guys don't know who this guy is, he's from the original Red Dead Redemption games. Come on then, let's get back to the others. Yeah. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. Up there! Four of them! Oh, shoot. Go, 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 go. Any more, Arthur? Don't 
think so. Jesus! You still with us, Marston? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. Did I? of us are lucky right now. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. No problem. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, I think. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're gonna get out of this. I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks, I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. No problem. Again. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Oh, we got two missions. We get strong, we get warm, and we wait. All right, let's do this mission. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea. 50 days and you unfortunately survive when we ran away from Blackwater I wasn't able to get supplies in well when government agents are hunting you down sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short we'll survive we always have and if needs be we can eat you you're the fattest I sent Lenny and Bill hunting and they found nothing well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough, enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> All right, let's go hunting. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn. I imagine. All right. Let's head out. How are you holding 
up, Charles. I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. Yeah, I'm not good with bows either. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't an Odriscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <sighs> Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater. Getting stuck in the storm. Bringing John back in. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Some patches of grass here. This is good. Come on, let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. Hmm. The wind's died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Now shh, stay quiet. Yeah. Hold. Stop here a second. I see something. What do you see? <sighs> There's deer been here. And recently. How'd you know it's a deer? How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. The gun will scare everything around. Quiet as you can. Stay low and move slowly. Um, you see the tracks? I uh, yes. think so. Maybe not. Focus. I see it. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Alright, gotta be very quiet. I feel like this is where in like the winter area in, ba in the scene of Bambi. Shh. Oh, there it is. Down there. You see him? Good shot. Oh, what a shot. Now let's try for another.
I'll just take my arrow. Go. Oh, this is what it got me frostbite in real life. I don't even know how cold this place is. Up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. <laughs> I, wish, I wonder if I could do the whistle later. Woo -woo. <laughs> that noise. Even though I can't whistle, that's sad. Water horse. Good, huh? yep. Ready to head back when you are. Come on then. Let's head back. Yeah. I don't know what deer tastes like. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna have a comment that says like nice chicken. Work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We'll still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch yeah, we'll and Jose will south. have a plan. We'll go to Canada. Oh wait, what am I saying? Where are you in Canada? You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. A lot of mouths to feed. And that girl from the ranch now, too. But not sure she'll be eating much. She has a wild look in her eye. You would, too. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. Huh. So what do we do with her? Once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. So it was O'Driscoll's you ran into there? Yeah. <laughs> Last thing we was expecting. What is it with the O'Driscoll's? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well... We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Ooh. Let's see if we can find another way around. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Cut up here, off the trail. Down, we'll see. Whoa, boys. We ain't ever talked that much, you mean. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? 
Something like that? But you didn't expect this? What? Any of this? Blackwater mess? Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall. Ooh. Sorry. Uh, careful. I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. Taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. That saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the cow. What is Brown Jack? Huck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I'm gonna hitch tie him over here. Brought some food back, boys! We're eating good tonight, boys. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Oh, and, uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well! <clears throat> Here, here's your meat. What a surprise! I find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, it oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. I'll get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one if you dumped on the floor there. All right, if you're schemish, kids, look away. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> <gasps> Oh, 
All right. I... Well, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. If you want, if you like it, leave us a like down below. Click subscribe, click notification, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Remember, stay awesome.